Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you hear any uh, basketballs in the uh, background, it's because my neighbor is uh, shooting some hoops. But, uh, you know, you just got to make your videos whenever you make them and you can't control other people. So there you go. Anyways, I uh, wanted to talk about how my sunfish uh, collection is growing because uh, when I got my first uh, sunfish, which was this uh, Marbles, I forget who it was that told me is that e either you will, uh, you know, throw it away or you're going to buy another one. And, uh, well, you can kind of see how I felt about them. Uh, so we'll kind of do a comparison of both, but we'll go over the features of this one because this is the subject of our review. This is the uh, Rough Rider Blue Mule Sunfish. So let's take a, a look at this. So you have this great equal-ended uh, sunfish, and it has uh, blue G10 covers, and it has brushed steel bolsters, steel pins. It does have uh, brass uh, liners. Uh, here is the uh, back construction, which is, you know, I think really good. Uh, this is probably the least expensive uh, sunfish that you're going to find. It's a little scuffed already because, you know, I, I did take it to work because, you know, hey, you got to test them out. And this one actually is really cool because it's got a really nice, super strong pull to it, which I like that. It does have half stops. Uh, right now, we're looking at the uh, main blade, which is a two and three quarter inch spear point, uh, 440A stainless blades with uh, satin finish. You know, uh, this thing cuts like a dream. It's actually really, really good. And I found that it fits in my hand really, really nice. I liked how it gives you a full, comfortable grip. And I was really kind of surprised that a knife this large would be... Uh, you know, really comfortable to have. Now, I didn't have a, uh, uh, as you can tell, this thing is really tough to uh, open. This is a little two inch spear point that it has. But like I was saying, I didn't have a slip that this could fit into, uh, but I did uh, wrap it up in a uh, bandana. So I think it got some scuffs from uh, keys and whatnot anyways, but I tried to protect it to keep it kind of nice. But anyone using this knife, the uh, main blade kind of curls under. You can get your fingers around it. It's not too, too bad. There's a little positioning on the uh, middle finger that you might have to, you know, mess with, or you can just fold it down here too. But the uh, secondary blade was not uh, hard to use at all. What I thought was interesting is that if you go onto the uh, websites, they, uh, for Smoky Mountain, it lists this knife and the uh, marbles as uh, weighing the same, and they don't. The blades are the same, but this white bone uh, marbles, uh, it has not as strong of a backspring, uh, but it still has pretty much the, uh, the same blade set. You know, the blade shapes are a little bit different, but they're the same, the same length. You still got a spear point. Uh, the marbles, of course, has the uh, nickel silver, uh, bolsters and the brass pins and brass liners and of course these beautiful white bone uh, covers. Uh, both of these knives are just uh, fantastic but the uh, Blue Mules are set up as a uh, work knife and this one like I said does not even have close to the uh, pull of the uh, of the Blue Mule. So here's your smaller blade on the marbles. But according to the website, they list both of these guys as uh, 3.92 ounces. So I took and got our little uh, kitchen scale and uh, tried them out. And uh, this guy here is uh, 5.9 ounces. And this guy here is 6.6 .6 ounces. And before anybody says, you know, wow, my gosh, those are so heavy. I'd never carry them because uh, they just are, you know, way too much. Uh, this off-grid knife here, uh, this guy here, he's 6.6 uh, .6 ounces. So weighs the same as that. The difference is, you know, bigger blade. And, of course, this one has a uh, pocket clip. But uh, not exactly a uh, pocket dropper either. 
you will know that you have any of these, you know, in your pocket. But uh, if you're looking for like a super heavy duty work knife, I think that uh, that Blue Mule definitely uh, takes the uh, cake. These guys are pretty uh, much a, a little bit bigger than a standard trapper. Standard trappers like, you know, uh, four and a eighth, and these guys are four and a quarter when they're closed which is not really, you know, that big, but it's about the same size as your standard trapper. So that's uh, pretty much everything on this one as far as the uh, the review and the specs. Definitely recommend this. If you're interested in trying the sunfish pattern, uh, this is the way to go. Get one of these blue mules, try it out, see if you like it. You won't be out a bunch of money. I still think these are right around uh, $12 or so. I'm, I'm not sure on the price. You can correct me in the comments uh, if you wish. But uh, this is the way to go. Get one of these guys. Try it out. If you like it, then you can get another one. If you don't like it, then you're not out a whole lot of money and you still got a really good knife to uh, throw into your uh, toolbox or tackle box or anything like that. Because uh, these knives, that's that's a worker and it will uh, do whatever you need it to do all day long, every day. Uh, just a, a fantastic knife. Uh, we're getting close. Uh, was checking the subscription numbers or subscriber numbers, and we're just below 760. We will be having an awesome giveaway at uh, 777. Uh, be sure to check the uh, description box in the uh, video because there are some uh, some great deals that are going on. I did see where, uh, if you hadn't heard, Schrade is having a huge blowout sale. They have a outlet section on their website. So if you like uh, the different knives that they make, uh, you might want to go ahead and get a, uh, pick up a, a Schrade knife of some type and get it at a discount. That's always good. Uh, of course, I have a uh, code to use with old timer knives, and I have a uh, discount with uh, American Buffalo Knife and Tool. So if you're interested in getting a fantastic knife like this uh, Roper Trapper, the Laredo Trapper, uh, you can definitely uh, get one of those, and they're 20% off, and they offer uh, free shipping as well. Uh, other than that, just check out the channels in the channel list. I've added a couple of new ones. Uh, you guys might find some uh, some new favorites. But that's all I have uh, for you guys on this one, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the comments section. Bye.